Hello everyone and welcome to Blackstar Potential. My name is Lee Fuge and I'm here today with MusicTeacher.com and in this video we're going to learn another riff that you guys have requested in the YouTube comments. This is the classic riff for the intro for the Joan Jett track, I Love Rock and Roll. All the tones you're hearing in this video are coming from the Blackstar HT20 Mark II which is currently set to the Overdrive channel and I'm using my Shergold Provocateur for this with the bridge humbucker engaged. So here's the riff in full and then we'll break it down. So for the most part, this is a pretty straightforward power chord riff using the E5 power chord, the A5, and the B5. So those are the only three chords we're actually using for the entire riff. But there is a weird bar towards the end of this where it just shifts into 3-4 for a bar before going back to 4-4. Four, four. So there is some little timing things there to watch out for. So the first bar of this riff is based around the E5 power chord. I'm doing a double hit of the chord on the one end and the three end. On the fourth beat, I'm doing a muted hit. So you can do this on one string or you can mute all the strings, whatever's more comfortable. And then I'm hitting the third fret of the low E and giving that a quarter tone bend. Now the timing of this is I'm actually doing a 16th note on the mute, so that's four, and then I'm hitting the bend on the E. So if I'm counting 16th notes, four E and a, so it's four E. So it's got a slightly rushed feel. Don't forget that little quarter tone bend, that makes a big difference. The second bar is the same rhythm, except this time I'm doing the A5 on the one and the B5 on the three beat. And that mute and bend are also there. So here's the first two bars. The third bar is exactly the same as the first bar, so back to that E5. So the fourth bar is where the bar of three, four comes in. So instead of counting four beats, I'm just counting three. On the one beat, I'm playing the A5 twice. And on the third beat, I'm playing the B5 and the A5. So three and. So it's one and on the A, three and on the B to A. As soon as you go from that B to A, you're going straight back to two hits on the E5, which again now falls on the one beat, and then you rest for the rest of the next bar. So that comes in on the one, and then you've got a three beat pause. So here's the riff up to that point. After that three beat rest, we then hit the E5 chord on the one beat again, but then we've got a lead lick to end the riff. So the E5 falls on the one end again, but then I'm coming up then to the first position of the E minor pentatonic scale. And I'm playing a bend on the 15th fret of the B, so I'm going up a full tone and releasing it. And as I release it, I'm pulling off to the 12. And then I'm playing 14 and 12 on the G. So here's that riff in full played slowly. And once again at full speed. So 
So there you go, there is the intro riff for the Joan Jett track, I Love Rock and Roll. Don't forget to let us know down below in the comments what other riffs you'd like to see us break down in future videos. There are a bunch of other riffs and other lesson videos over on the Black Star YouTube channel, so go check those out as well. And if you're looking for a guitar teacher in your area, please check out musicteacher.com. There's a great network of teachers all around the country waiting to help you guys out. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon.